All right, trick violation. We're talking step-ons to backslides. Oh my damn. We're talking mistrials that look like they're in a long distance relationship. <laughs> We're talking not in the groove or also on two different continents. Would you like any butter with that roll top sides? Bruh. That one there was a violation. Personally, I wouldn't have it. Stinkers, absolute stinkers. They're all in there. <laughs> and before anybody starts getting shirty, starts getting a little bit emotional i hold my hands up i am guilty of it as well man i've had a few points docked off my rollerblading license i've been up in front of that council more times than i care to remember for all sorts of friggin felonies i nearly lost my license over this absolute monstrosity the council was just like they were livid oh brother this guy stinks they were frothing from the mouth over this one they come making that shit up shameful Blah. God knows how I kept my license, but I did. Just a couple of points, one month ban, I was back in the game, and I learned my lesson. Contenders, ready! Mistrials and all the variations, top sides, misfits, alley-oop mistrials. Mate, keep them feet together. Perfect. Keep the kids together, please. <laughs> Hall and Oates, mate, better together. Noel and Liam, just stop squabbling. Together, man, together. Chips and curry sauce, together. Not in the pot. Look at this Miss Jar man. It's like they've had a fight. One of them's gone out drinking, come home hours later than they said they would, and they're out and they're just not even talking anymore. It's like Moses has turned up and just parted the ocean. <laughs> Get open. There's a whole person in the gap. As a rule of thumb, if you can see a person between the gap, definitely doesn't count. The council is going to be on to you big time. You have no authority here, Jackie Weaver. No authority at all. There's another one at the same place, mate. Lucky the council weren't there. They would have shut the whole thing down. I can still see that bloke through the gap. I don't want to see him anymore. I'm sick of that t-shirt. It's a bit of an epidemic, man. They're cropping up all over the place. The woman was too stunned to speak. It's not a new thing either. They've been around for time. And it's no less of a fine as well if the feet start together but then break up halfway through. Oh my goodness, you had it. You had it there. Just need to hold on, mate. Work out your differences. Stay together. You were mates, now you're bloody like pen pals, man. You don't even freaking text each other anymore. Ghosted each other. Now this one's absolutely heartbreaking. You can see they're trying to make up their differences. They're in communication. They're like, come on, should we give it a try? But no, just didn't happen in the end. They just couldn't get past it. That back foot's dating Mizu at the same time as the Mistral. Please give me a chance. No, I seen you with Mizu the other day, man. You're always cheating on me behind my back. Just make your mind up. It's pretty much the same rule for sunny days, whatever you want to call them. Close the curtains, man. Keep the feet together. If you're watching, you close the curtains. Easy way to remember it. I mean, unless you're like some sort of freak, and you open up the curtains, get yourself in trouble for that. I actually believe this one was an on the spot. Fine, man, look at the gap play. Is that a toll booth? Is that where I put my money? Put it in and the bridge goes up. Flipping hell, man. You had enough time to like switch the foot. You definitely had time to put it together. One point off your license for, sh for sure. Probably more. They'll, they'll decide, not me. Just because you stuck a fakey 360 at the beginning before you did the trick does in no way allow your feet to just explode. What's going on, like? Different postcodes, man. Clearly got the talent to like full cab, fakey 360, but sticking together. Don't even look like it was that hard for you. Just get back up and do it again. Who's your cameraman as well? You've got a responsibility to like go politely. That wasn't, wasn't it. I don't want the council breathing down my neck about this, right? You'll get in trouble, I'll get in trouble, and we'll just get stick. Get back up there and do it again. Bruh. No. The devil is warming up a seat in hell for this one. Fair enough, you're on a chain. It's wobbling all over the place. There's all sorts of variables with it. But man, just like, pull up your fly. Just think of it that way. Think of it as you're going skating, with the legs apart, yeah, that's your fly undone. Just zip it up. <laughs> Grinding chains looks mad fun though. The Greg Preston, mate, he doesn't mess about. Get in there, Greg, man. Come on, the standard forward, or it's like sunny day as some people call it. That's getting a bit more like value, mate. That's going up, the stock's in that. You need to start doing them and get them really nice. But when it's not in the groove, oh God, like when the foot's like flapping, flapping around all over the place, like, oh, God, it's disgusting. Hi, uh, yeah, can we get the uh, VAR on that one, please, VAR? Yeah, can you uh, can you check if that actually went in? Yeah, no. 
Nah, not in, not in. No goal, no way. <laughs> Has to be in the groove, like Malcolm in the friggin' middle. So we're saying Mistral no gap, no gap, X grind, definitely no gap on that. Flipping hell. That is like having stabilizers on your bike or something, man. You're not a kid. It's fine if you're just starting and you're learning it. Yeah, get a nice bit of stability for yourself. And just bring it in, mate. It'll look proper class. Talk souls with a gap. Oh my goodness, me. <laughs> rotten. Absolutely dot cotton rotten. Absolutely stunning trick when done well. No. It's all nice and tucked in. Oh, it's just a great shape, man. Get that in a friggin' museum, man. Oh. <laughs> The day the pioneers came up with this one, oh, they were having a sensational day. Look at this thing of beauty. We have made this for you. Take care of it. And what are we doing? Big gaps and the friggin' talk, but not even down, not even down. That's like taking a picture of a newborn baby with a friggin' Game Boy camera, man. God's sake. Bit of a honeymoon period on this one. It's all nice and together to begin with, and all of a sudden they start drifting apart. They've got other interests, they've got other people in their lives. You know, they just don't have the time for the relationship. Emotional damage! Look at this one, man. Done a load of good work, getting into a really nice stylish position. This one's kind of like, you know, building a house with all the bells and whistles, but then not putting a door on the friggin' thing. Like, there's no friggin' door, like, just finish it off. Finish off the job, man. It's a little bit like a fake Rolex or something. This is definitely a talk show from the market. This is Weebok, man. You're spinning the yarn a bit, you're telling a great story, you've got everybody convinced it's the real thing. It's all just on a bed of lies. Oh, oh, almost fell for that one, almost fell for it. You've even come in with the Tyrannosaurus Rex arms, giving it all the style, giving it all the beans, but just couldn't put the talk down. And that is definitely what was meant to be happening there as well. <laughs> And it's the same for Roy's and Favs. Just like, just get them down, man. Like, they look lovely when they're down. Like, you've grinded the whole thing. I mean, that must have felt pretty sweet, like. Sweet like Tropicana. Just the feet need to go down, come on. Down, 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 down. Other violations include pencil spins. Nah, man, like, just get a little bit of a tuck on it, like proper fryer tuck yourself up there have a good time like a cannonball man not a friggin hb like <laughs> next up in the dock to be judged step on grinds oh my goodness me steps for getting from one floor to another good steps steps the british pop band good steps underrated steps actually step brothers good film steps into grinds no man get it. Go back to bed, like, sleep it off. Here comes Hot Stepper Murderer. Murdering that trick, and not in a good way. Man, I've been guilty of this a fair few times myself, like, you just creep up on you. Sometimes you don't even realize you're doing it. What you need is a good, honest pal who has your, like, well-being in mind. Somebody that can up to you and go, look, right, mate, pull your pants up, put on your big boy jumper, and let's get to work. Let's do it again. I've experienced that. My friend told me straight. He was like, you stepped into it, do it again. So I did and it worked, it's good. Let you in on a little secret. There's a loophole in the law on that one. Med spin, med spin into a grind, mate. You get that one foot up, everybody's like, oh, he's doing a med spin. Nobody realizes you're just stepping into a trick. Mate, I do that. Now, very often the crime is committed when people are going into backslides, especially if they're switching out of the backslide. That seems to happen a fair bit, but it's not where they're limited to. The criminals are fairly clever, always coming up with new ways to scam you. This is the latest one. Stepping into tough or heel rolls. Flipping neck, man. It's like a move from line dancing or something. Woo! Talking of rolls. Bruh. Why? <laughs> Don't get me wrong, a 540 disaster mono roll is pretty ridiculously good, if that's what you were going for, but I've seen your submission form for the end of the year and you submitted that as a 540 alley-oop fish brain. That is what we call a penguin, mate. That is not gonna fly. Bacon roll, Swiss roll, commando roll, sushi roll, rolling rat, roll on deodorant, rolling a fatty, rolling over in bed, all great rolls. Rolling top sides, not so great. It's like rolling your ankle. Wow. But you know, just call it something different. That's the easiest way to do it. Just say, I wasn't even doing a top side, I was doing something else. Ah, oh, and it's as easy as that. Find a square rail, roll a top side, get that top side foot just rolling on it and the front foot the normal way, mate. 
you absolute psychopath, that'd be mega. These are also on the naughty list, by the way. I've rolled over in my time and seen a few howlers in the morning, but that is a ridiculous roll like. Okay. <laughs> it looks fun though and very tempting to do. It's kind of like when you're on a bridge or you're on a cliff and you get that like feeling that you just want to chuck your phone off it. Yeah, it's kind of like that feeling, you want to do it, but you know you shouldn't. Not locking top sides properly is also a little bit heinous. The first and third seem perfectly fine, just the second one, man. Just let yourself go a little bit. Just get the thing locked up like, death row style. Just get locked, banged up, done. Definitely covered this before, but toe rolls or heel rolls when that other leg, when the loose leg is shaking like a shitting dog. No, man, you've got to calm that thing down like bit of CBD oil or something out, like chill out on the leg. Mazugans, like bringing an acoustic guitar to a party. Flip it now, man, just do the trick properly. Like, if you don't know, it's a nougan where your foot is like so tilted, it kind of looks like you're almost in a mizu. Yeah. Imagine how upset your kids would be if you were late to pick them up from school. Oh man, there'd be tears. It'd just be an absolute mess. Really, really sad situation. It's the same thing for grabs. You were meant to pick the kids up at one, you rocked up at six. <laughs> That's a good trick as well, man. Just don't even bother with the grab, just leave it. Freestyle the trick, same thing. Rocking up to work, still half cut at like midday, man. No, man, to take the day off. There's variations as well. There's a catch and release, you know, catch it, but then release it too early, you know. Drop the fish back in the river. <laughs> There's also the hesitation and really quick regret, all the regret of a weekend in like one second. There's also the fumbler, the trout tickler, landing in the lava. Basically, it's when you do a topside trick, say if you're going left foot topside, it's when you land on the right side. That was a far side. Oof, scorched. There's times where you can do that on purpose and it looks pretty good. You just gotta call it. Got to call the shot before you take it, like in pool and that. Now, if you meet somebody who claims they've never done one of these things, brr, they are talking absolute tripe, man. Everyone's done it. Everyone's been there. And you know, it's just a laugh. You can learn from these things, man. On a semi-serious note, it's important to have trick names and then like guidance that goes with that name. It allows people to learn better, you know? They'll be better with the trick that they're doing because they know they're doing it right. It will look good to people. It translates really well. But that's a whole nother massive conversation. And you know, like rules are there to be broken. Sometimes when you break the rules, you come up with something else that's like even better or maybe just like good. <laughs> Don't take any of it seriously, it's all just a bit of fun, unless you're in a competition and then you've got to do it proper because otherwise the judges are never going to give you it, are they? It's just the way it goes. Like, comment, subscribe. <laughs> Not so sure how well that's going to go down. If you like these videos, you can actually support me. Maybe if you got called out, you might not want to part with some of your change. You might want to part with like a horrible message to me, but you know, I won't take it to heart. I did this video the other day on Senate and Cryptonics, talking about all the interesting packaging that they had, the stories behind that, including things like Dave Colash, Blueberry Special K wheels that absolutely stunk. There's action figures in there, all sorts of stuff like that. Oh yeah, and by the way, there's a few tricks in this I haven't included. So if you want to see me do another one of these, let me know. Otherwise, uh, spotty dog. <laughs>